Hello everyone, welcome to Learn and Innovate, your learning and research support channel. In this video, we're going to learn on how to configure a static network in Windows Server 2022. Let us start with defining what is a static IP address. A static IP address is a 32-bit IP address that is manually configured for a device instead of an IP address assigned by a DHCP server. In the example, the IP address has been written in both the binary notation and the dotted decimal notation. An IP address can be divided into two parts, the network ID and the host ID. The 32 bits of an IP address are divided into four octets and the address space is divided into five classes. That is class A, class B, class C, class D, and class E. Class A addresses were designed for large organizations with a large number of attached devices or routers. The first octet of a class A address ranges from 0 to 127. Class B addresses were designed for mid-sized organizations with tens of thousands of attached devices or routers. The first octet of class B address ranges from 128 to 191. Class C IP addresses were designed for small organizations with a small number of attached devices or routers. The first octet of a class C address ranges from 192 to 223. Class D IP addresses, on the other hand, were designed for multicasting. The first octet of a class D address ranges from 224 to 239. The class E IP addresses were reserved for future use. The first octet of a class E address ranges from 240 to 255. So how do we configure a static network in Windows Server 2022? By default, the IP address is assigned by DHCP. To configure the static network, just follow the following steps. Step 1. On the Windows Server 2022 GUI, open the Server Manager dashboard, select Local Server from the left pane, and on the right pane, click Ethernet. Right-click on the Ethernet icon and click on Properties. Another method to get to the Properties dialog box is to double-click the Ethernet icon and click the Properties button. Then, in the Ethernet Properties dialog box, click Internet Protocol version 4 TCP IPv4. In the Properties dialog box of the Internet Protocol version 4 TCP IPv4, set the static IP address, the gateway, and other details and click on OK. Again, click OK. Now, the changes are enabled on the Server Manager. Thank you for watching and watch out for our next learning and research support videos. Please support this channel by hitting the like and subscribe buttons.